What the hell was I supposed to do on the channel? There was something, something I was supposed to do. Oh yeah, something with this video. The Republic Commando Arc Trooper mod. Right. What was I supposed to do again? How exactly did you install? Is this on Steam? <laughs> if so, how do I download the mods? Could somebody make a video how to install the Arc Trooper mod to Republic Commando, please? Well, I guess I'll have to. Alright, so what you're gonna need, first you're gonna need the game installed somewhere. Me, I have it through Steam. That's fantastic. Most of this is gonna be through Steam. Um, so, you go on the website, which I will have this link in the description as website. You need to download all four of these links. If they make a 5.0 or if they make a new bug fix, you probably should download those. So what you're going to do is you're going to download this. I will have each one of these as links as download this first. I'll have download one, download two, download three, uh, download four. Yes, this is all safe. I've done it before. You click on download now. If it doesn't start in a mirror, you click the button. You hit allow because I've done it. It's safe. You can trust it. I got two because somehow it did go through. So I'll cancel that one. And in about like... Six to a half an hour, this will be done. So we'll come back in like a half an hour. All right, so now that this is done, you're going to open it. You can drag, click and drag it wherever the hell you'd like to do it. You're going to open it again. Now, do not forget to read the instructions on the website. So, it says... Nothing. So, I don't know, here we go. It says make sure to download the separate map pack. Install instructions, extract two program files. LucasArts Republic Commando game data. That's if you're playing on a disc or pirated version. See all this? Again, the README. Make sure to download all new maps. Fix bugs, textures, blah, blah, blah. So, if you're doing it on Steam, you might as well leave this pathway open. You're going to do almost exactly the same thing, except for LucasArts, you're just going to go to Steam. Then you're going to go to Steam Apps, Common, because they moved everything. Then you're going to go to the Republic Commando, or Star Wars Republic Commando. You're going to go to the Game Data. And you're just going to take all these folders and throw them right in there. Very similar if you've modded any other Star Wars game that runs through Steam. Which is why I got annoyed that I had to make a video of this. Because I'm sure most of the people who asked for one... Uh, pretty sure they uh, modded Star Wars Battlefront 2. And if they did, they probably ran through my video. So this will take, uh, let's say, about 30 seconds. We'll have a jump cut instead of me turning the recording off. And here we go. It only took a minute to throw all that in there. You are totally going to want to do all this for all of them. You're going to want to merge them all. And then, yes, because this is a conversion pack, you're going to want to move and replace. Now, of course, you could set it up as two different files. So that way you have two different setups. So that way you don't have to uninstall and reinstall Republic Commando every time you want to play it, but it's a short little game. It's uh, it only took me half an hour to re-download it. So I mean the mods are the big pain. He has to download. Actually, downloading a game through Steam didn't take that long. But wait, you're not done. That's just one part. Don't forget you have to download these four mods. Now to make sure that I don't hear any questions, how do you download these? We're gonna go through it. So like I said, you need to download this one. This is the first one. And you have to do it in order. Download number one first. Download number two first. Download three. Download four. In that order. One, two, three, four. So this is the map pack. It came second, so you download it second. Like it says right here in the description, download the 4.0 beta first. You screw that up, it's not going to come out right, and then your game is broken. Download everything in order. I know it's, I sound like a jerk repeating this over and over again, but trust me, you guys screw that up all the time. Don't mean to clump you up with sad people, but you guys do it all the time. 
these are the actual custom mo uh, maps that are in this. At least the training map's a little custom. Uh, extended prologue, Camino, all that stuff. It's going to take about an hour. It is a big file. They did change a lot. It is worth having it on. You need it to play this mod. We'll be back. Hey, all right, look. Network error. You know what that means. Where did we put that thing? Yay. Network error. Thank you, Apogee. You fuck. Ah. All right, now that that didn't take two hours like the first time, it only took me exactly three minutes, you're going to, you know, move it to whatever the hell you want, and you're going to open it. Thank God you kept that pathway open to your game data. Like I said, you're going to open it. Ah! Don't open 15 instances of it like I did. You don't want to do that. Thanks. So, see how there's a map folder in here? You're going to take this, you're just going to shove it in there. And look, it's going by nice and quickly. Yeah, and you're going to do that. You're going to move and replace everything. There you have it. But wait. There's more, because remember, there are bugs. So, now that you've finished downloading the maps, move on to download number three. Download a third. Bam, you click on the download button. And you make sure that you get it going. Hope I didn't just screw that up. I think I did. Like I said, you're going to click the download, and then you're going to click that just in case it doesn't start automatically. There we go. It says it's going to take four hours. It's probably not. We'll be back. Maybe I'll have another error. All right, now that that's done, I'm going to suggest if you get something that says like 19 hours, you cancel it and restart the download, because that's what I've been doing. So again, do whatever the hell you want with it. Thank God you kept this pathway open. So it just says mod. So again, it's this stuff, statistic meshes. You go in here, you're going to be replacing stuff again. Shouldn't take that long. See, it's going to take like 10 seconds. Gee, lordies, you're going to take 10 seconds. I hope you all download this in the proper order. That's in the description. You hear done. We're moving stuff. And yeah, again, you're going to want to just move and replace. Because it's a total conversion mod. If you want to get away uh, around that, I'd suggest making two sets of this. One the real game, one the mod. So now, you're almost done. You only have one final thing to download. And that are, that is, these bug, these bug patches. So you're going to click download, and you're going to wait for it to do it by itself. Because I think that may be screwing me over. Oh, stretch. We're going to have a nice good stretch here. A nice good stretch. Maybe this won't download. Yeah, again, you just click it if it won't load. If it opens up like this, just... Uh, I do not own on home, but I have an HH. I do not. Or just answer it. These aren't real. Like, they don't freaking... Uh, they're not really, it's it's weird. I know that looks like a survey thing that's going to hack your info, but it's it's like a lot of general info. Just answer it. It's not, it's not a virus. It's very real. And look, two minutes. So this should download smoothly, hopefully. Watch that fucking crash. We'll be back. All right, woo! Last one. You're almost done. You can almost play. Again, whatever you want. Good thing you kept that pathway open this whole time. Make it easy for yourself. Or if not, just keep opening my damn video and bringing up the view stats. So, again, just take this stuff here. Because it all fixes the bugs. So you're going to want to replace everything that's in these folders here. And then there's going to be that message. You're going to want to hit yeah for all three. And then you're going to want to hit move and replace for whatever the hell is in here. And then, boom, you should be done. And then, hopefully, and just to clear up my desktop, I'm getting rid of this. Bonk. Now it's still in there. So hopefully, 
If you now go to Steam, uh, which I had closed, <laughs> hopefully if you now go to Steam, it'll play perfectly with this mod. Now, again, I said this in the beginning, if you're not playing on Steam, you're going to do the pathway that was described here, which is very similar to what I did. Program files, you go to LucasArts instead of Republic Commando. Program files. You find LucasArts that may very well have destroyed mine. Nope. You go to LucasArts, Republic Commando will be in here, and then you find the game data for that, and you put it all in there. Just like I've been doing this whole time. Um, it's very simple. So now let's go on Steam. Alright, here we go. Don't you dare fucking ask me how to load up Star Wars Republic Commando on Steam. Something like this. We. Oh, look at that. The mod loading. It's also really loud because I've never done these settings before. My ear. My god, that hurts so much. Did you hear that? Lower everything. So the game, yeah, whatever, graphics. We're not gonna go through all this. We can change this later. Done. You just want to see if it works. Now, the campaign map, there's the prologue. Thanks, Johnny. Thanks for hopping on. But we're just going to hit a new game. And you should start off in the mod. Now, we're not going to go over the whole damn mod here. Maybe I'll bring my Let's Play back. I'll have to go back to where I was before. But we're just investigating. We're investigating right now. Welcome, little one. Dog, oh, a little baby. This is your first day. Hi, is the mod the working? Will be up here. Can you tell me? Zero one slash one three eight. I want to know if the mod is working, please. We expect great things from you. I expect greatness from this mod. Some jerk asked me why would you you're ru you're ruining a great game, time. sir. Uh, I'm going to tell you what, time. playing the game over and over and over again, like I did on Republic Commando on the on the original that Xbox, what I was calling it Xbox One for the longest time, traits. which made more sense. I can tell that he's reskinned already, too. Um, having a, a full conversion mod like this and is tons of fun regard, and helps stuff out. You will be superior it makes it to not as boring. So, my Braithrin... I can tell that these Republic uh, Commandos are reskinned, which is good. Dun 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 Commanders, you I salute you. Oh yes. See that? See how he's not in commando really armor? Special. Oh, I am lieutenant. Your oh, they actually did change this texture since I played it before. And most importantly, I think brothers. anyway. My brothers. The Eifer of our world. Hunt in pods to bring down much larger prey. Take it down. So too shall you uh, join the right, where are my weapons? And become fierce hunters for the Republic. Now, what about my mini -gun? join your pod. And embrace Damn. your destiny as their leader. As my their leader? Join Delta Squad. What am I doing with my helmet still? Delta Foro. Hello, gentlemen. A pure and uncomplicated soldier. Yes. Six Salute. Two. The heart and soul of your team, and O seven, the fiercest Sav, look of at all me. your brothers. You there are we each go. a piece of a whole person. Yeah. And the Republic will call you to defend and give your life. All right. Well, I can tell you right now that this is working. So, if if your game doesn't look like this, you did not follow my instructions throughout the video. I hope you've enjoyed this. I'm the F-Bomb here on Nick Bro Inc. End of the video spiel. Come back to our channel. We love you guys as friends. We love friends. Come back, friends. A friend is a friend.